Hey y'all, time for a new video. In today's video, I'm gonna talk about some drugstore lipsticks that I found at Target. All these are under $6. They all look beautiful on women of color. I thought this would be such a great idea because everybody likes to save money and you don't always wanna wear your high-end products on a daily basis. So when you can find a dupe or something comparable for a cheaper price, why not go for it? Also, Target is so accessible, everybody loves to shop at Target, and I thought this would be a great video to show you guys. These colors all look great on women with brown skin, and all these colors work for fall and winter, which is the season we're currently in and the season we're coming up on. So if you want to see the brands, the prices, and the swatches, then keep watching. Okay, the first lipstick we have here is a L'Oreal Paris collection. This is an exclusive um, collab. I'm gonna be honest, I don't know who this person is, but I will put all of the information that I find down in the description box. This is a beautiful bronzy, um, kind of a wine color with a little bit of a bronze or shimmer to it. It's absolutely gorgeous. I like the packaging. It's really nice and velvety and it feels high end. This lipstick was $5.99. There was also um, a Cartwheel special when I bought it, so there was an additional 20% off when I purchased it. The next one we have is from the same collection. It's a L'Oreal Paris lipstick. This is also a beautiful, beautiful winter color. This is like the kind of go-to um, kind of berry color that I love, especially in the winter. I think it looks so good against brown skin. It's not a bright, bright red like a, um, it's not like a ruby woo red, but it's not too deep either. It's really, really pretty. This was also $5.99 with an additional 20% off at my local Target, so you can check this one out as well. This next one is number 255. It's called Tempting Toffee. This is by CoverGirl. This is more of a nude, but it is a really, really good nude for women of color. I think nudes work great in the winter. What you can do is you can play around with your lip pencil color to give you more of a vibe of fall or winter or cold outside type weather. This was also $5.99. The CoverGirl was not on sale, so it was strictly $5.99, but that's still a great deal when you consider that MAC lipsticks are going to run you about $18. Next up, we have <laughs> Toasted Truffle. This is a matte shade. It's number 570. This is a Maybelline color, and honestly, I think Maybelline is one of the better drugstore brands, in my opinion. I really like the products that they put out. This is also more of a nude kind of color, but it has more payoff than the last one. So this is leaning more towards a mauve uh, taupe kind of blend. This one was also $5.99. And again, it's a matte from the new um, collection. And this is called Toasted Truffle. Last up, we have another Maybelline color. This is number 696. It's called Burgundy Blush. It's also a matte shade. And this is a really, really pretty deep matte lipstick. It's like a burgundy, like the name suggests, burgundy wine-ish type of color. But what I like about drugstore mattes sometimes is that they're not truly matte. Like if you go get a liquid lipstick that's matte, that's like matte, matte, matte. These tend to be more of a satin, but like a dried down satin. So they wear better. They feel much better on the lips. They don't feel as crackly or as drying. And these are affordable as well. This one was also $5.99. And I think it looks beautiful, beautiful on brown skin, especially in the cooler months. Okay, you guys, that was it. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video. I will leave all the information down in the description box. Also, if you guys wanna see me do this version um, for lip glosses, so affordable lip glosses of, for women of color that I can find at drugstores, leave that comment and I will go ahead and prep that video for you guys. Also, if you haven't subscribed and you like my content, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button before you leave. If you are a subscriber, thank you so much for watching and supporting as always. Any questions or comments, leave them down below and I will get back to you guys. And until next time, y'all, bye.